Hey everybody, my name is Captain Moore. Welcome back for another video of Star Wars The Old Republic. Continue this series, you boys, right into a cutscene. We're on Balmora we right now. To. What do you want? I, I was trying to do an intro, my guy. Uh, I'm busy, kids. Take a number and get in line. You see this blaster? It means we get the jump to the front of the line. What do you mean? I've got a blaster too. You, and we expect payment in full. We Corellians are very particular about our debts. You killed our brother Vex, you pile of scum. You got anything to say for yourself? What? Who the fuck is Vex? Take off before you regret it. We're not afraid of you, and neither was Vex. He was the galaxy's best gunfighter. He was that Corellian bank robber on Hutter, right? The fast draw guy. That was the guy. You take him in a stand-up fight, so you shot him in the back. Now you're going to pay the price. The name Taro Blood ring a bell? He told us how you slaughtered Vex and then killed the old man, Brayden, when he discovered your crime. Brayden? I, I can't believe even Taro would stoop that low. What? Taro lied to you. He's playing these two. This pair of Corellians are nothing but Taro's pawns. Enough. Let's fry the scum and be done with it. You're dead. No, you're no, I'm not. First off, you need to chill. I don't know what's your problem. I didn't do anything. Oh, the goddamn an evasive, huh? All right, buddy. Whatever. I don't know what's their problem, boys. Why are they attacking me? I didn't do nothing to them. They were just straight up attacking me. I'm just going to Balmora. So here we are, boys. I guess just right off the bat, we're going to Balmora. We get jumped. That shit's crazy. What the hell? All right, let's see right here. So the capital, no, not the capital. What am I talking about? Capital city of the Imperial is uh, drum and cast. But this, well, Mora is a pretty important planet in itself. I guess it's a one of these planets that's uh, war zone Come all again. the time. So very interesting. I'm gonna lag a lot. I feel like right now I'm already starting to lag. Holy shit! The frames, boys, are dropping big time. Look at this. Warzone big time right here. Shadows of Wrath. Okay. Let me see really quick. Uh, report to Lieutenant Major Peril. Which is in there. Let's go ahead and uh, join him really quick. Let's go boys. Really excited to continue this storyline right here. See where this is going to lead us. We're start officially beginning the Great Hunt. Uh, and, uh, hopefully there's not going to be too many people jumping me for no reason. Welcome to the office of Lieutenant Major Perel. I am ODX-9. How may I be of assistance? Uh, I need to see... You see that? Mako is like invisible right now. That's weird. I've got an appointment. Perel sent for me, didn't he tell you? That's odd. I have no record of an appointment in my scheduling databanks. If I may inquire, with whom do I have the pleasure of speaking? My name isn't important. I'm in a hurry. You know what? My name isn't important. I'm a bounty hunter. That's all you need to know. A bounty hunter? Oh, how interesting. I don't believe I've ever met one of you. My sincerest apologies, but the Lieutenant Major is currently in a meeting and cannot be disturbed. Thank you for visiting Lieutenant Major Perel's office. Have a pleasant day. Okay. You're dead, fella. What was that racket? ODX! ODX, answer me, you worthless piece of junk! Who's out there? I'm here to solve your problems, bounty hunter. My problems? What do you know about my problems? Ah, of course. I understand. Uh, give me a moment to unlock the door. Perel's our only connection to Admiral Ivernus, so let's make Lieutenant Major a very satisfied customer. Michael, you got a problem. I can't see you. There we go. You've got a power or something that uh, permits you to be invisible? What the hell's going on here? Where you were? I couldn't see you in this cutscene, my girl. Holy shit! All right, Peral. You got something for me? My apologies for the poor welcome. I never informed that idiot droid I was hiring a bounty hunter. I'm assistant to the naval attaché of the governor of Balmora. I specialize in intelligence gathering. Master is wise and powerful. This is Mergir, an amusing gift from a friend on Drummond Cass. 
For what she lacks in intelligence, she makes up for in entertainment value. Let's get down to business, shall we? My superior, Colonel Sashius, is an incompetent fool. I toil in his shadow, though his job should rightfully be mine. You're obviously more deserving of power. Precisely. Even you can see it. But what's most infuriating is that Colonel Sashius has the full confidence of Admiral Ivanus. Colonel Sashius remains in power because he excels at hiding his gross incompetence from the Admiral. But we are going to tear down that facade. Uh, how will we do that? Then the Admiral turns on uh, turns to you. The Colonel loses his job. Admiral Ivernus comes here and gives you a promotion. We're going to work well together. I can tell. I want you to create problems for Colonel Sashius. Problems I'm confident he can't deal with. Your missions will involve plenty of mayhem and destruction. And the pay is quite generous. Oh, is it now? Interested? You said the magic words. Generous pay is my favorite term. Excellent. We speak the same language then. Your first target is the Okara droid factory. Before the Empire invaded Balmora, we sabotaged the facility, turning the droids into crazed killing machines. Colonel Sashius is very close to deciphering the facility's control codes. If he does, it will bring the droids fully under the Empire's control. The Colonel cannot be allowed such a victory. I sent a data slicer to enter a code scrambling virus into the facility's computer system. What do you need me for? What's the problem? The security team escorting the slicer was killed by the facility's droids. Now the slicer is trapped inside. The you slicer need to refuses retrieve to it, input the virus until I send a rescue team. I'm sending you. The slicer's name is Zalia. Force her to input the virus into the system. Then eliminate her. No loose ends. We'll have more business to discuss when you return. Alrighty then. Alright boys. First mission on Balmora, let's go. We gotta get that thing, speak to Zalia, do, tell her to do something and then uh, kill her off. She'll have a nice surprise in there, holy shit. Alright then, let's go kill her off I guess. Uh, and retrieve the item he needs. Oh my god, I'm, my frame rates are dropping big time. What the... Okay, I know where the speeder is. I am used to be on Balrora. Well, I went there be a lot of, a lot of times, so... Basically know I, where I'm going right now. These these uh, regular planets, these uh, first planets that we're going through, Nar Shada and stuff, these are planets that basically both sides go through. Uh, both Republic and Imperial, so you kind of know where you go going uh, after a while, you know, you you know uh, your locations and everything, you know the planet uh, like it's in your, your own child or whatever. Okay, let's go boys. I'll see you in a, a quick uh, second. I'm just gonna do a, a transition here. Alright, here we are in the camp. Just uh, got out of the speeder. We're gonna get into the battlefield right here. Let's go boys. I, I kind of like the... There's a lot of planets I like a lot in this game. Some planets just look plain beautiful. I think my favorite is probably Quesh. Right? Uh, Quesh or another one uh, of them. I don't remember which one it is. But there's some planets are just beautiful. Titan is a, a really beautiful planet. We won't be able to go to it, I believe. Well, eventually we will. But that's kind of a spoiler. So I'm not going to... Even though I already said it, but um, uh, right now, as it uh, as it is, we're not. Uh, it's going to be a while since we uh, since we go before we go to uh, Titan, I should say. So I don't know. There's a lot of planets. Like this is a a pretty beautiful planet. It's a good planet. It's it's kind of like Earth, but it's a, it's like a, a battlefield place. Like right, it's a lot of uh, a lot of soldiers. So it's more or less like. Uh, I don't know. I don't know what kind of country it reminds me of, but it's it's beautiful. But it's just the trenches and everything. I like it's it has its own thing, right? 
has its own thing. So, I guess uh, I, I guess I like Balmora a lot. Narshada, the the, the 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 planets basically that I don't like is Narshada, Coruscant. Coruscant, I kind of like it. The way it's constructed, it actually looks good. But the regular Coruscant, I don't like so much. I don't know, boys. Just like the big city planets are the planets that I don't like, and the uh, the main planets. And not the main planets, but the planets with a lot more na na nature on it, and uh, less. I guess less building is the ones I prefer the most. Okay, so this I don't need. I already have. Uh, I'm good on that part. We're gonna have to fight our, uh, our way through, everyone. Let me just uh, go ahead and use the speeder really quick, so we can just uh, go a little bit faster here. There we go. All right, so we're gonna we're gonna shoot them. We gotta fight them off anyway, so we might as might as well uh, get rid of them really quick. I can't. Uh, I'm so I'm still used to playing my shadow character, so my Jedi shadow character. Oh my god, this is a bigger one. We're just gonna attack him. Probably gonna give us some nice bonus. He's a, a, a mini boss and stuff. Come on, let's go get him. All right, get some uh, bonuses here. That's a really nice uh, attack right there. That attack right here, the, f oh, the flaming fist, that's a good one. Let me see real quick, did we get anything? We didn't get anything. Why? It's not giving us anything for the mini boss, that's not good. Alright, let's go into the elevator, I guess. I don't know how many missions we're going to be able to do in this one. But oh, there she is already. Alright, that's... These missions are kind of... Like, they're really not difficult to do at all. Where are you, who are you hiding from? What are you doing there? You're a Zalian of Slicer, right? Perel sent me. Yeah. Thank the stars. I don't know how much longer I could have held out. My reconnaissance team was evaluating the factory's computer systems when the droids overpowered us. The droids slaughtered my team. I've been stuck here for days without food, water, or sleep. Finish your mission. I'm here to make sure you input the virus. You know about that? But I can't do what Perel wants. It's impossible. If Why not? I put the virus in the computer's control program, it'll trigger alarms. Those droids will swarm us. Not if I blast them first. I'll make a nice big scrap pile out of them. There are dozens of them out there. Crazy killing machines. You can't fight them all. We've we'll see about that. Situations. We'll be fine. You're totally set on this, aren't you? Okay. There goes nothing. Alright, she's activating it. Here they come, boys. I really don't care. I mean, they're not that big of a trouble. That's it. Alright. That's all you've got. Uh, that's gonna be easy. Let's go. Yeah, I'm, I'm killing all of them easily. What the hell? Is that all you've got? That's what you were scared of? Anything else? That's what you were scared of? Defeat the second wave. Oh, there they are. There is a little bit more of a challenge here. Not that much, but come on now. Alright. Alright, good, good, good. Let me just do that really quick. Let's go, boys. Just do that really quick. There we go. My flames are going to do a little bit more damage here. And that's about it. Really? That's what you were scared of, Zadia. Come on now. That was nothing. I can't believe we're still alive. What are you talking about? Don't act so surprised. Oh my stars. Thank you. You're amazing. I've never seen anything like that. I'm bailing out of here before more droids show up. Running away never felt so good. Uh not a chance. How? Okay, no. You know what? I'm supposed to kill you, actually. I wasn't sent here to rescue you, Zalia. Oh. Oh, no. Please don't kill me. I swear I'll go straight. I'll never slice another computer. Just let me go. No deal. A contract's a contract. You're asking me to break my deal with Perel. I have a family to take care of. Parents who depend on me. I'm begging you. Pearl's an idiot anyway. He'd never know if you let her go. Alright, disappear. 
Buy your freedom. You gotta buy your freedom. I like things done clean. Make the loose end worth it to me. Pharrell paid me in advance. I stashed the credits. Let me go, and I'll tell you where. The credits are in a lockbox. Here's the location and the code to open the box. They're all yours. Should have never quit my job at the cantina. See, I'm not all that bad. I'm not gonna kill her. I'm gonna get the... She's, he's gonna pay me either way. He doesn't know that Z I didn't kill Zalia. Uh, so for him, I did the job. Plus, she's paying me for, to stay alive. So if they're willing me uh, willing to pay me to stay alive, then I'll, I'll generously take the money and leave them alive. I don't need to kill everyone. I'm, I'm a bounty hunter. I'm there for the money. I only talk about the money. So, I mean, if they're willing to... Like, I don't have a code per se, right? Uh, yes, I got to get the job done. But at the same time, you know, if they want to stay alive, that's fine by me. All right, here we go. We're back at Solbrick, boys. Got to talk again to uh, Mr. Perel. Tell him our job is over. For all we know, for all he knows, I should say, the job's completely over. So Zalia is dead. Uh, it is mine. So that's good. So she's still alive. So I, you know, I saved a life today. And I got some money for it. So all good to me, boys. All good for me. Welcome back. I take it everything went well, and the Okara droid factory is running smoothly? And what about Zalia? I trust that slicer won't be a problem. John was that to spec. What slicer, Lieutenant Major? Ah, yes. What slicer, indeed. The Admiral will soon see my worth. Master is so wise. Remain silent, my pet. Or I shall discipline you again. And you don't want that, do you? Here is your payment for taking care of the slicer, my friend. Excellent work. Your next assignment concerns the local fauna. Colonel Sarsius is that responsible ours, for keeping our citizenry safe from the deadly colicoids infesting this planet. Never heard of these colicoids before. Colicoids are vicious, giant, insect-like creatures that devour anything in their path. Their exact origin on Valmora is unclear. After the Empire's invasion, the Balmorans released mutated colicoids into the wilderness. The creatures successfully bred and have become a plague on the population. The colicoids have become almost docile in recent months. Attacks are down all across the planet. That makes Colonel Sarsius look like he's got this plague under control. But we know better, don't we? I'm not interested in guessing games, Perel. What's your plan? Simple. If docile colicoids are the problem, then we must strive to make them hostile again. The last time they attacked in force was when a survey team accidentally encountered a colicoid queen. It took five squads to kill her. Alright then. Uh, call Wraith about Bloodthirsty. Okay. You see where this is going? Yeah, you want me to kill that queen. Alright, tell me about the target. I need to know what tools to take for the job. Uh, I will suicide, but my ever foully master and me device something to assist Place you. Place this sonic okay. device near the nest entrance. It will confuse and anger the colicoids. Kill any drones and warriors you see. Eventually, the queen will reveal herself. The sonic device will disorient her, leveling the playing field so you get a fair shot. Be fast and careful. All right, boys. That's it then. Second mission on our way. Uh, actually, I really don't trust that pet of her, of his. I feel like she he she's hiding something. Oh, we got a new ability. Old timer like me got a lot Power of Power yield. To sell. I don't know what that is, but I'll take it. All right. Um, Come back. You might learn something. Yeah, I don't know, boys. I don't know. I don't trust that pet of hers. 
Uh, she seems like she's spying on us or something. I feel like she's probably a Republic spy. That's just my feeling. The way she looks back at us and stuff. She did slick, man. I, I'm seeing it. None of my business, of course. I'm just a bounty hunter, but that's going to be a problem for Mr. Perel, that's for sure. All right, here we go, boys. We're going into the camp right here. There's going to be a lot of droids. It's, it's a resistant place, right? So a lot of droids, a lot of, uh, of players here. So, not players, but a lot of NPCs. So, you go ahead and kill them. There we go. Uh, we got a job to do here. So, we got to find our way on the bottom. Completely on the bottom. Is that it? Can I jump? I think I'm supposed to... Huh. I think I'm... I can probably jump. Let me try it out. There I go. Try it out like this. Try to... Uh, Come so uh, cut some corners here, boys. Let's go. All right, I found my way uh, where I'm, I was supposed to go. So this is the the general area I'm supposed to go at. There's a lot. There's going to be a lot of people trying to attack me right now. Uh, hopefully, I can evade them eventually. Shit, face man. Oh my god, there's so many soldiers here. Am I good? Am I good? Can I enter? I can't enter. I'm gonna have to kill them. All right, fine by me. Fine by me if I have to kill them. Let's go, man. There we go. Just kill him. And get rid of him. Oh, my God. That didn't work. What the hell? All right, let's go. Let's get out of here, boys. Got to enter this place here. Plant the sonic device. Yeah, I got easily lost. I didn't go at the same, uh, at the right place at all. all right, I just got to kill these Cody cords. Everything I see in front of me, I got to kill. Where did they go? I guess they uh, they just went away, right? Oh no, they just they're spawning back, boys! Holy shit! Ah, uh, these Cody codes, I don't like them because they can just do that. Oh boy, it's like got them. Uh, they're annoying as hell. Ah uh, fuck! All right, let me just go ahead and do uh, whatever. Yeah, they they just spawn back in your face, and that's really annoying. Let's go. I do, I do uh, start to uh, know what I'm supposed to do, right? For if I want to use a gun more often, vent heat and explosive fuel if I want to use the flames more often. I think that's how it's supposed to work. So I'm going to try to do that more often. Uh, this is the egg right here, the color code egg. Right. Let's go. Is that the queen that's coming in or something? No. Okay, so that's just the... Uh, there we go. Just gotta kill them, I think. Let's go. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Kill them all. Kill all of them. Let's go. Got this. There we go. Ah, shit. I did not... I didn't... I don't think I was supposed to uh, shoot at them. Okay. You know what? You're, you're being annoying here. There we go. Alright. No, you don't. There's a lot of them. I'm just going to use my, uh, there we go, my double attack. And just to use all of them. All right. Defeat the third wave of Koli, of Koli Cord. Will do. Will do, boys. No problem whatsoever. My God. Me fighting bots. How would you have known? Huh? Would you have think that that's what I was uh, going to do in this video? Just being a bug as Terminator, boys. Holy shit. Let's go. All right, I think the queen. Yeah, prepare to face the queen. I'm prepared. I'm good. She's about to uh, come in now. All right, where's she at? Oh fuck! What just happened? Oh, there she is. Oh my god! All right. Well, there it is, boys. Let's go. My oh my god! She's got evasives. All right, let's go. We got this. Uh, I'm just gonna go ahead and you know what? How about like frozen carbonite? Oh, that didn't work. That did not work. I mean, it, it did stop her for a, se a split second, but it didn't really work. Just gonna go ahead and do that. And there, there it is. Actually, that was easy. What? How is everyone having so much t uh, of a tough time? Like, what is this, boys? I don't get it. I don't get how they're having such a tough time. Report back to the, the lieutenant. All right. We're going back to Sobrik. These missions are really easy at the beginning here. 
I mean, I'm losing a lot more health than I usually do when I play with a Jedi or whatever. I feel like I'm doing a lot more damage, though. Uh, that's the thing, boys. So we're back in Sobrek. I think that's how it works, right? You're a gunslinger. You do a lot more damage than with a lightsaber for some reason. But if you're a Jedi, though, you have more, a lot more health, so you last longer. That's interesting. I don't know which I prefer. It would really be good if you could have the two of them together. But you can't have everything, right? You're alive. Magnificent. Frantic reports of colicoid attacks are pouring in from all over the planet. I've included a generous bonus with your payment. Colonel Sartius is going absolutely insane. <laughs> Once Sartius is removed from his position, Admiral Ivanus will certainly consider my application for a promotion. It's a flawless plan. Don't you agree? Do I look like someone who knows how to impress admirals? Well, I am the most qualified. The Admiral is a very intelligent man. My application will speak for itself. But what if it doesn't? What if it doesn't? Bounty Hunter, though clearly unlearned in these things, you do know how to hunt any prey. Tell me how to approach the Admiral. How to approach him? Make him come here? Show him your strength? Face to face. Don't hide behind reports and applications. Meet him personally. Interesting. Don't simply offer my name up to the Admiral as a choice to replace Colonel Sartius. Make myself the choice. If things got bad enough here, Admiral Ivanus would want to conduct another inspection. That could be my opportunity to meet and impress him. I need one final brilliant maneuver to arrange my face-to-face -face meeting with Admiral Ivanus. And I know just what to do. Reports indicate that the Republic forces that stayed on Balmora after we invaded are training resistant fighters at the Balmoran Arms Factory. Bet they kept you busy. Yeah. At least those resistance fighters make your life more interesting. They're terrorists and criminals. If not for the Republic's aid, they'd be harmless. The Colonel has learned of a secret rendezvous between the resistance leaders and several off-world allies. His spies planted a homing beacon aboard the Resistance Leader's command shuttle. You're going to remove that beacon. Uh, you mean destroy it? Uh, don't I get to kill anybody? You know what? You mean destroy when you it? say remove, I hear vaporize. Uh, no, no. The beacon must remain intact. You will move the beacon from the shuttle to a garbage transport. The Colonel will swoop in with his warships to find nothing but garbage sifting Ugnaughts. The shuttle is in the spaceport at the fortified Balmoran Arms Factory. Be cautious. What are they looking at each other for? That was weird. Okay. So that's just a decoy he wants me to do now. Let me just uh, do that really quick. Better armor and everything. Okay. And uh, what about this? Thir 20, that's 36. So I'm going to give her that. All right, boys. Very interesting. Uh, interesting mission. I don't know if what I think about it, really. I feel like it's a waste of time. Is he paying me for do to do this? Because if he's not paying me, why am I doing it? He, he didn't say he was paying me, that's for sure. I'm going to trust him, but if someone... I'm coming in towards someone that wants to pay me instead of him... I'll choose the other person because he didn't tell me specifically that he would pay me for this mission. And uh, I don't know. I don't trust him right now. I don't trust him. Let's go to that location, boys. Uh, last mission we're going to do. All right, here we go, boys. We're going into the facility. It's right over there. Hopefully nobody spots us beforehand so we don't have to shoot anybody before going into this uh, little factory, whatever it is. So... I managed to evade any droid that was on my uh, in my way. That's good for me. Now we are go def definitely going to have to fight some people, though. I feel this like because a it's a there's a lot of NPCs in here. That's going to be rough. Like this without outside help. Yeah, there's a lot of NPCs here. This is going to be rough. I'm going to have to shoot this guy. Definitely going to have to do it. But uh, at least I don't have to, um, you know, take you. care of the other ones. I will have to take care of the other NPCs. The less NPCs I can, uh, I have to kill, the better. 
Just want to get through these uh, quick successions of uh, story right here. I'm going to kill them. There we go. And just do that really quick. Get rid of them. There we go. Let's go. Uh, I think we're supposed to go there. I'm going to do uh, deal with this uh, really quick. All right. Let's just do that. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Kill that uh, little droid right there. It's not going to die, man. Holy shit. That droid. Sometimes they don't die so easily. They're really tough. I don't know. I, I do feel like I'm doing a lot more damage than if I was a Jedi. But it's not that much of a difference. It's just a slight tight difference. But the difference for the elves, though, the health is quite a, a lot bigger. So I don't know, boys. I don't want to think. Oh shit, I'm stuck. What the hell? That's what happens when you look at your uh, where you're supposed to go. You just held them out really quick right there. There we go. There we go. I'm gonna help them out. I'm a gentleman. Oh, I gotta go in quick. Go, 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 go. Oh, fuck. I, can't, I didn't make it, boys. Shit, that's the downside of not having the goddamn sprint thing. Why don't I have that? Like, is it really only a Jedi thing? The, the whole sprint? How come I don't have that? That's ridiculous. Oh, whatever. Let's go. Got a lot of people here. We got uh, these two guys. Got them. Got a Sith Juggernaut in here. A mercenary. Interesting. That Sith Juggernaut looks like a... Uh, like a, an early, he's got like a early Mandalorian armor type of stuff. That seems pretty interesting in itself. I like his armor a lot. Like it's like a Kotor uh, type of a Sith armor, or whatever. It's interesting. Right, let's go, boys. Let us all go. Okay, uh, where do we? Okay, so there's the, the the factory. I don't know if I'm gonna do the entire mission. Well, I should be doing you know if i start a mission i should complete it i guess yeah we'll, we'll complete it the, the video is going to be a little bit longer than usual but hey, it is what it is it's fine as long as i finish the mission i'm fine with it okay more more of them where do okay so i gotta go on this side right here okay just gotta go on this quick little side right there just gotta try to evade all these people go in there not gonna use my thing. It's the only thing I got is the rocket boost. Usually I use this the speed thing to the the sprint thing with the Jedi, but I don't have it in this situation, so I gotta make do without it. Let's go. Kill these guys real quick. Okay, we're good. Do I have to kill him? I don't think I have to. No, I don't I don't have to kill uh, him. I gotta get past them. And uh, it should be on the ship right there. Remove the beacon. Okay, let me just kill these guys. They're in the, uh, they're in my way right now, so kill them really quick. Let's go. All right, good. Just get these credits. Uh, where's the beacon at? It's right over there. Oh shit, I'm not close enough. Oh uh, shit, there we go. All right, let's go. We got it, boys. It's the beacon. What now? Well, there's somebody. Okay, defeat the resistance. Okay, fine. Oh my god, he came in pair, huh? That's interesting. All right, you wanna fight? Let's go. Got you, bitch. Okay, plant the oming beacon. So now we gotta go. Uh, where exactly? Uh, I think I gotta. All right, I won't fast travel. Because I don't know exactly where it is. Because it's an elevator thing, and that's that's a big oof right now. Whatever, man. I'll I'll, I'll see what I can do, boys. I won't uh, get you. I won't bother you all for for this little part right here. I, I gotta travel, so give me a second. All right, so we weren't that far away. We actually just had to step outside of this factory, and uh, the the uh, place there where we're supposed to take uh, or get the thing at is here so let's just go in I f we're definitely gonna probably have to but I don't I don't think we have to shoot him no never mind we're definitely gonna have to shoot him boys just gonna put a shield on 
right here. Why not? And there we go. He's dead. Easy, boys. I wanted to uh, try to not shoot in for once, but oh well. There we go. There's a the mission done. Turn back to Perel. Will do, boys. Back to Sobrek. Final time, I hope that we get to see him because uh, I want to end this video right here. All right, here we go, boys. Back in Sobrek. What am I telling you right here, huh? How many times are we going to have to talk to this guy? Now, are you Success. actually going to pay me for this deal? Because I, I didn't do this for free. Sarsius has been placed under arrest. Under arrest. If only I could have been there when Sarsius led his men into that garbage transport. Weapons drawn. <laughs> Morgir swoons in admiration for Master. This is priceless. Admiral Ivanus is already on his way. He wants us to meet at the spaceport. You've done me a great service, Bounty Hunter. Credits feel insufficient. How can I better reward you? I'd like to meet this admiral. Spread my name. Oh, you know what? I just like credits. Having plenty of money is never a bad thing. I shall make you one of the richest bounty hunters in the galaxy. Well, that's the good then. Naval attaché to the governor of Balmora will need individuals like you. I'm sure the admiral will agree. Meet me at the spaceport. Your presence as part of the grand entourage I present to Admiral Ivanus will make the occasion truly memorable. Morgir wants to go. Morgir can be part of the occasion. Oh, very well. But mind your place. I'll see you at the Admiral's docking bay, bounty hunter. Don't be late. A very bright future awaits us. All right, boys. Looks like we're done. Uh, I think we're done with this uh, this whole area, this uh, uh, Balmora, with Balmora in itself. I think we're already done. Right? Meet at the spaceport. Is that what was? Yeah, meet at the spaceport. So I think we just gotta meet him, meet with him, and uh, then we'll just be finished uh, with this place. I guess we're gonna head out to Narshada afterwards. Uh, pretty easy missions, like literally three missions to do. Only three missions that he gave us, and that was pretty much it. And easy missions, easy money. Let me just see really quick how much money I got from that. I don't know how much money he gave me. Probably it's going to give me... Event <sighs> see, I don't know how much money I gain. I, I should probably look every time. I don't know, boys. Anyways, I'm going to see you all for the next one, where we're going to travel to Narshada. Uh, definitely, probably, right? So remember to leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. I'll see you all for the next one. Keep it easy.